and here is another uh, written description only type of order which is my second favorite order and the one that's basically like a dream come true type and uh, I live for these and hopefully one day there'll be more uh, full-time which is why I'm transitioning to so with this the client ordered uh, me requested their written description was Ikrinus, uh sorry Ikrin I think um, humanoid male and they wanted rated R too. So uh, at first, <laughs> I forgot equine could mean other than actual horse species. It could mean like all the horse types. So and then I was like, <gasps> uh, zebra automatically popped into my head because you don't really see zebras uh, that often, and when you do, you don't see them properly represented. And so I wanted to add to that uh, pool. <laughs> so to speak and what's fun about the zebra uh, anthros anthro is that you could go so many different ways with it and there's so many uh, different ways you could interpret the patterns and how they do with the humanoid factor and so um, so if this I went uh bit more humanoid because uh, I really wanted to show the facial structure and um, yeah so the face is completely human but uh, and most of the body <laughs> but I, I like humanoid I like I actually prefer half and half with anthros rather than mostly animal but um Anyway, so I gave them hooves because it seemed more fitting than human feet. And um, and what I looked forward to the most with this was the interpretation of the coloring of uh, the stripes. And <laughs> at first I was going to have the arm down, but uh, it looked weird. So that's why I moved it up. And, um, and actually, I just went by memory of the zebra, <laughs> so I couldn't quite, I don't think I could quite remember exactly how the tail went, but I'm like, it's a fucking anthro, it could be whatever the fuck I want, <laughs> that space that, uh, just that's, uh, gives justice to the species it's, uh, inspired by. So, um, I was like, anything else beyond that, it's like up to me. So, um, and I really wanted to, uh, give him a full filled body. Well, mainly an ass, <laughs> but I give everyone an ass. <laughs> uh, uh, but it fit for this. And, um, uh, I'm not saying all, um, black people have asses. Cause I don't, well, I have a ass at the bottom. <laughs> Like, I like the bottom part of my ass. But anyway, uh, so uh, at first right here, I knew I wanted the face to be close to black. Um, oh, and the client also ordered uh, scars. And so I put a few scars here. And I thought I would give him a, um, they call it, one of the terms is gasclo. Uh Glasgow, Glasgow, uh, smile, um, that goes, that makes it, that cuts through the, uh, corners of the mouth, so, um, I thought that would be interesting <laughs> for him, and it just fit, um, most of the time, I don't, I can't really put into words why it fits, it's just, I think of how the character is, and it's just like a, it's an unverbal type of realization, uh, if that makes sense. <laughs> and um, so, but yeah, uh, so I wanted the face to have that black that zebras have, and I wanted it to blend downward. And at first, I didn't know how I was gonna do the legs, but then suddenly I was like, I was thinking of those zebras where it seems like they're rear end is more uh, white color so that's where um, I was like okay yeah let's have it like that 
and I wanted it to be balanced really so it's all about balance I think everything is to make sure just um, balance each other out because <laughs> that's what looks good to me and I really dig the design I hope the client digs them too but uh, I don't think I really thought of uh, personality or, or anything for them, well, my version of them. And that's the fun part with these, is that um, I still own the complete rights to every all my designs, but um, the client is shared with them, some of them. Um, so they have their version of the character and then I can have mine. And most of the time, I usually don't do anything with them, but sometimes I I can't help but like have my own version. But this one I don't really have a version. I just wanted him to look good and gorgeous. <laughs> so thank you very much. Bye.